Hey guys, this is Danny's Auto Repair. Today I'm going to be doing a quick video on this E2 Lab half drive click torque wrench. Now this one goes from 10 foot pounds to 170, 170 foot pounds and from 10 to 227 newton meters. Okay, let me see if I can turn on this light here. So there you have it guys. This is the TW170F and it says here when the torque wrench is not in use please adjust it to the minimum torque settings which is 10 foot pounds. Okay. It's very nice. I like this green color by E2 Lab. So back here you have more information. This has uh, it comes with a manual, certificate of calibration, and a blow molding box, and of course the uh, torque wrench. Now the technical data also here it says model number TW170F. Drive is a uh, half square. Graduated range as from 10 to 170 foot pounds and from 10 to 227 newton meters now it says the increment 1 foot pounds the increment I believe accuracy is within it says plus 3 percent to plus C plus 6 percent CCW unit foot pounds and newton meters the ratchet is 72 teeth C, CR V wrench type click torque wrench torque locking mode push pull type material 42C MO plus 50 BV30 plus aluminum Seven, the length is 17 inches the finish is electro black and then it says here te testing standard ASME and then all these numbers here so let's check this out guys let's see what else it says here okay it says high precision clear reading wide range micro scale CR-V durable drive 72 teeth dual range and torque instructions so the dual range is from newton meters to foot pounds and vice versa so let's open this up it has this nice green case and you open the clips here very nice and you have the torque wrench right here Okay, so let's put this to the side and like I was reading before you have your little manual here always check your manual gives you information about it and how to use it there's also different language here a different language okay so always check your manual guys so this is the certificate of calibration so there you have it guys okay so this is the torque wrench right here green you have your locking button here like I was reading okay so that means when you put the socket here let me see I have a socket here let me get it real quick so I can show you guys Okay. So let's say you see the socket has a hole there. Put it here. And then you got to press the green button and it locks it automatically. It's not coming out. See that? Okay. So then you press the button again and it comes out. See that?
so it's automatically locked there so it will not come out and you see here it says foot pounds right there then you turn it around Newton meters okay so you have your reverse and your forward uh, mechanism here okay that's forward and this is reverse okay so now let's say you want to set it to let's say 34 pounds so you would push this down okay this black part push it down and then you turn it clockwise and you go all the way to the zero right there then you let it go okay that is already set so that's 10 foot pounds right there I mean yeah 10 foot pounds you see the zero right here that's the zero right there and the 10 is right here you want to get it right on the bottom line of the 10 that's 10 foot pounds right there okay that's how you set it so like I said you hold this down then you turn it clockwise or counterclockwise okay you turn it clockwise to go up and you turn it counterclockwise to go back down it only goes up to 10 so you can't go below 10 okay and then when you finish using it you go right back down here to 10 and leave it alone that's the lowest setting okay 10 foot pounds and then you can store it and put it away but it feels nice it feels heavy duty I love this green color it's awesome beautiful color that's the name right there E2 lab okay very nice see it says store at lowest setting which the lowest setting is 10 foot pounds so there you have it guys by E2 lab so what I'm gonna do now is I'm gonna go downstairs and torque a few things down on my car so you guys can check this out okay so I will be right back guys and also I'm gonna put a link in the description to where you can find this at okay so I'll be right back let me go to my car okay guys I'm back I'm gonna torque these to 35 I'm gonna torque this one here for the mount to 50 foot pounds and then I'm gonna torque these right here to 24 foot pounds So, like I said, this is the uh, nice torque wrench from the guys at E2 Lab. Thank you very much, guys. So, let's get started. So, the foot pounds is right here. And then you have the Newton meters over here on this side. Okay. So, now this is uh, 50 foot pounds. So, let's set it to 50 foot pounds here. So, when you set it, like I said, you push this down and then you turn it. So let me go 50. What I like about this torque wrench is that it's very easy to, uh, to spin. It's not like some cars where it's like, I mean some torque, wrench, some torque wrenches where it's hard to spin. So right there is 50 foot pounds guys. Okay. It's already set. get the uh, where did I put the socket let me get the socket over so this socket is 15 It's so cold today guys oh my god New York City here the weather is crazy right now like I said you have the locking 
socket here, the locking feature to lock the socket on your torque wrench. This little button here. It's very nice, guys. So, here we go. So now I gotta hold this side because it spins. We're gonna put this wrench here. So once you hear the clicking noise, that means it's already reached the, the torque spike. Right there. Let's see. No, not yet. Guys can see that that clicking noise. Okay. That's fifty foot pounds right there. Okay. Let's see if you guys can see. Yeah. Once you hear that clicking sound. Right there. That's it. <clears throat> so these right here, we're gonna torque them to 35 foot pounds. Right here. Hopefully this phone stays here. These right here guys. So I'm gonna set this to 35 guys. So right there is 30. Right there is 30. So you wanna go all the way to number five. And that's 35. Right there. there that's 35 right there oops sorry guys Now we're gonna do these right here. <clears throat> these are the uh, top strut uh, torque nuts right here. So those go up to 24 foot pounds. So let me set the torque wrench here. Very easy to operate this torque wrench, guys. That's 24 foot pounds right there. Okay? Very easy. torque wrench by E2 Black and when you're done guys you want to put this torque wrench to the lowest setting so just bring it all the way to like let's say 10 I always bring it to zero right there yeah right there I always 
leave it all the way at the bottom, okay? Right there. And that's pretty much it, guys. So all in all, this torque wrench performed very nicely. And there you have it, by E2. Okay? So I'm gonna put a link in the description to where you can find this at. It works flawlessly. So like, share, subscribe. God bless.